guys are going with finger drums. You know, I've been known to do a get their own finger drum or two. I'm nervous about this coffee, man. Dandy blend? Have you heard of this? What does it really call that? Or dandy. Dandy, not dandy. Not dandy. People that don't drink coffee. Oh, that's odd. Yeah. I like it. I'm scared. I'm scared too. Jimmy Chimmy sandwich? Oh, that's cheese. Thanks, bro. Enjoy. The bacon scram and cheese sandwich, no tomato. Enjoy. No tomato? Yeah. Crazy? Thank bacon you. Bacon tender milk. Thank you. No, I, care. I don't care for sriracha. I care for sriracha flavored things, as far as like the actual sauce. I could literally do that. Oh, that is me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Ow, my finger. What did you end up getting? It's really uh, hot. Awesome, so fire. Wow. This place is smart. It's really good. Yeah. All right, so Dandy. Oh my God, dude, it's really hot. <laughs> I'm saying it's not for everyone. <laughs> you might like it though. Yeah. You like it? Yeah, I don't hate it. Yes, everybody is. Like immortal, you're burning my mouth while drinking it. But <laughs> that's also good. Oh, good. Yeah. That's good. There it is. <laughs> Biggest female music project. Like a female music is really good. It's a really good show. Really? I know it's the art too. I love it. Have you ever heard of Tal Wilkenfield? He's a bassist. He plays for uh, Jeff Beck. Oh. She's got the craziest hair. At least she's like, it's like weird though, because she's one of the ones where it's like I feel like what she does makes her hotter than oh, I see. I hope she physically. Oh, I see what you're saying. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. Like she's filthy at base. Oh, this isn't a music one, but well, you know, the movie Empire Records. She kind of shaves her head. Yeah. It's a big girl. Oh my god. Mm. This is my first, like, like, rock chick crush that I've ever had. One of my earliest crushes ever, Stacey Dash and Clueless. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, dude. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Hey, just take this to Yeah. Oh my god, wow, that That's good? That's good. So dude. what's the plot? What do you do? You gotta try try that one dude. Can I? Alright, I'll try it. You didn't try wow. PD Crunch? That's what I'm gonna get. Try it? No, but I'm gonna get it. You already just know. I just know. Whoa. Yeah, dude. You just wait, wait for the Yeah, mix. Yeah. Cold wow. spicy is cool. Are your cones vegan? Yes. They are. Yeah. <laughs> wow, dude. We're going all out, dude. What did you get? Peanut butter crunch and chocolate with Oreos and a waffle done. Yeah. I can't wait to put you eating the ice cream in slow motion. Is Gab yeah. gonna be the most awkward on camera? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Got it. Should we say a prayer before we eat? Andrea, dude! We didn't pray yet, dude! Do I look good in there? I feel like it's just like yeah, too close. Nice. Does it look terrible? Gina, get up. Gina, this is the first official Yak Squad hangout of 2017. I love that Anthony's not in the shot. I love that. It looks so much better when he's not in the shot. Can we get a little yak squat on three or no? Well, yeah, let's, uh, let's toast. Okay, dude. <laughs> All right, dude. It says, I love lesbians. Get it? You know, bean, just beans. Oh, there it is. There it is. Oh, sorry. Gina just said I was getting the wind in her face. Whoa. Zooming on her face now. All right, Gina, you want the limelight? There it is. What are you going to do with it? <laughs> 
Hands in the middle, dude. Should we not touch each other though? Yeah, I don't want to touch any of you guys, honestly. Yeah, squat on three. One, two, three. <laughs> okay, so it is Sunday. It is about four o'clock right now. And what better way to spend a beautiful spring Sunday afternoon than watch a bunch of adult men kill each other with light tubes and barbed wire. And that's what I'm gonna do. Deathmatch Wrestling in Freehold, New Jersey at Game Changer World. I'm going to meet up with some people. Um, Devin, JC, Julian, and I don't know who else. Probably a bunch of overweight, balding, gross, smelly men, because that's what wrestling is. Devin, I do want to say quickly that I respect your attire tonight. Dress shoes and sweatpants. Alright y'all, it is 1.30 in the morning and uh, it's the end of the vlog, which means again it's time for me to answer some of your questions. Again, thank you guys so much for commenting and asking questions, I appreciate it. I like ending the vlogs like this a lot, um, so keep them coming. Uh, I love doing it. So here we go, we're going to start off with the very first question. Good old Pabs asked, what's your go-to workout music? So basically my workout playlist is the weirdest collection of music ever. Songs that will never be in the same playlist ever. I have some instrumental bands on here. So Explosions in the Sky and This Will Destroy You. I have Kanye West on here. The National on here. Integrity, one of my favorite hardcore bands. Some Radiohead, some Motorhead. I have just about everything on here. Next question comes from Pez Productions. Favorite movies, movies you're excited to see. This is tough. So right off the bat, I could tell you that basically any movie that Quentin Tarantino, the Coen brothers, or Wes Anderson has ever directed, I'm a fan of. The Life Aquatic, Royal Tenenbaums, Moonrise Kingdom, and then you have Fargo, No Country for Old Men, and then you have uh, Pulp Fiction and Inglorious Bastards. I mean, those three guys are geniuses. I'm a big Batman fan. I have to put The Dark Knight on that list, right? And as much as I hate even putting it on my list and telling people that it's one of my favorite movies, Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind, in my opinion, is a flawless movie. I have never watched a movie that has moved me quite like that movie. I have only watched it one time, one time, and it was probably the worst time in my life to watch it, but I've only watched it one time, and that movie just messed me up big time, and I've never 
had that happen with a movie ever. Uh, I gotta put Rocky on the list too. Easily. I love, love, love the Rocky films so much. That's gotta be on the list. God, I could go on for days with this list. I don't know. Couple good movies coming out this year that I'm excited for. One is Blade Runner. I loved the first Blade Runner. It's like so nostalgic to me. Hopefully they do a good job with the remake. I'm looking forward to the superhero movies as well. So Spider-Man, Justice League, and um, Guardians of the Galaxy 2. Really looking forward to those, those three as well. So yeah, I guess those four, uh, I'd say, are my most anticipated movies for sure. Jason Mullen, what type of dog do you have and could we see him in the next episode? So, Mac is, I believe, part Shih Tzu and part Lhasa Apsa? Lhasa Apsa? La Lobster Apsa? I don't really know how to, I don't really know how to say it. Could we see him in the next episode? You wanna see him? Here. Here he is. Hector Decklerman asked, this channel won't survive. It's hmm. a weird, it's a weird question. Nathan Pontitian? Yeah, maybe, possibly. Any stories behind any of those tattoos? This question was pretty much inevitable, I think. So I'll only go through a couple. Here I have a baseball on my arm that is signed by my grandpa. Um, and then right next to it, I have a Robin with a cookie in its mouth. And these two are my two favorite tattoos. They're very special to me. They both represent my grandparents. They both live on Robin Court and the cookie in the mouth is for my grandma because her nickname is Cookie. I also have a moth on my chest, which you could kind of see it peeking out a little bit, I think. There you go. Terrible angle. But that is for one of my favorite TV shows of all time, which is Lost. And episode four is called The Moth. And it's a beautiful episode. And you should go watch that right now. If you haven't seen Lost, would... It, would Stop what you're doing and watch it now. Creative Curious Kara asked, would you ever consider going as Where's Waldo on Halloween for the memes? No, I never, never really crossed my mind, honestly. Thank you guys so much for your questions. Same routine as next video. Comment down below on this video, any question that you want me to answer and I will answer them next vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, then go ahead and hit the like button. Do it. That doesn't make sense why you wouldn't do it if you liked it. I don't get it. If you like me and if you want to see more of these vlogs and more of me, then go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And if you guys want to see more videos and if you guys want updates, go ahead and like my Facebook page. I will leave the link in the description as well. Usually I'll stress about how to end a video and I'll take like a million different awkward takes on how to end it, but I'm too tired. It's 2.30 in the morning and I need to sleep now. I need to go now. So thanks for watching guys. Until next time. Bye. So I almost forgot. I got a Facebook question from my old friend Jared. And Jared asked, where do you get the background instrumentals for your videos? Well, one of my best friends, Chris Mealy, has a project called Wave Cutters. And I will for sure link them in the description. So please be sure to check them out. They put out the craziest remixes and um, the most fire of beats, as the kids say. So definitely be sure to check them out. Um, and also shout out to Chris and thank you so much for providing me with all the music for my vlogs. It is much appreciated. Much love, dog. Second part of the question is, can you kick a freestyle? <sighs> dog, can I, can I kick a freestyle? Like, I'm not gonna hit you with, come on, dog. Like, if I got it, I will. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got the beat ready to go. Shout out to Wave Cutters.
Check it out. Vlog number eight. Yeah, 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 yeah. Vlog number eight, I'm freestyling. Vlog number eight, I'm still wildin'. I be wildin' out like Nick Cannon. My flow's so sharp, dog. You could call me Shannon. Number 88, shout out to the Broncos. It ain't Tuesday, but I'm about to eat some tacos. Maybe some nachos. With some sour cream, you know what I mean Cause I mean just like Joe Green Hold the caffeine, I don't do soda Instead I'd rather stick to some granola Ay, ay, cause I am too hot to handle I am similar, similar to a candle Yeah, and I be smooth just like butter I wanna give a shout out to Wave Cutters Do show, let's go You already know that your boy got the illest dang flow Ay yeah, I'm freestyling in the kitchen. Check that description. Ooh, okay, okay. I'm freestyling in the kitchen. Check the description. Hey, do show, let's go. Hey, do show, let's go. Hey, hey, do show. Hey, you already know. Hey, do show. Hey, you already know. Hey, dog, dog. I can do this all day, dog. Like. Don't show you already know. It's don't show what you know. Ayy.